And the thing is, yeah, I had all that big siren going off, and Claire's like, oh yeah, use the 12 shot grenade launcher and stuff like that, and I'm like, what? And she's like, use the 12 shot grenade launcher, I'm like, what? I couldn't fucking hear it, it's so loud in my ears and shit like that, so I'm like, what? 12 shot grenade launcher? No bitch, not bullet storm. And then I'm trying to think, what do they look like? Free ass monkeys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, the clock's green. Okay, cool, we can just chill out, piss around here. And then it goes red. And I'm like, oh my. Oh my. We could be in for trouble now. We could be in for problems. 1126? One, yes. I can remember five minutes ago. Right. Is that was already, yeah, he's already dead. I can't remember how we even trick it off. Oh yeah. Yeah, what the hell? Why does taking a painting off the wall trigger all that shit? Do they really like that? <laughs> the capture is labelled baby albinoid. Okay, okay. Yeah, that distracted me as well. The skeleton picture. I actually would like that picture. But that distracted me as well because I'm like, I want to see it on the back, I want to see it on the back, I want to see it on the back. Oh, no, shit's going off. Ass face. Free ass face. Was that two ass face? He's got three cheeks, but technically he'd only have two buttholes, so does that make him free assed or two assed? I'm actually thinking it might make him two assed. I'm not sure. Oh, I can't get out. It oh, the sh. Fuck off. Right. Let's get out of here. Down there. Oh, we got plenty of time. I think it's this door that shuts. Yes. It reckoned like it right close. Horse shit. I cleared that by about 15 seconds there. So, no. Where did I get out of that? A skeleton picture. What? Why? Why do we need a skeleton picture? Anything on the back? No. A human skeleton is outlined in blood. Ah! I remember... W I think... If memory serves correctly from about an hour ago, there was a room with pictures. And I think one was missing. So... Well, I think there was one missing, or... Maybe you can swap pictures or something like that. Who knows? Either way, that's the best clue I've got at the moment, so we're gonna go with it. Fuck dogs. Not literally, but you know what I mean. What? There's zombies back in here again. Oh shit, I killed you! not even dead. Oh my god. You get, they get up so fast as well. No, easy fella. Easy. Is he dead? Yes, he's dead because I can walk through him. As previously mentioned, Resident Evil Universe Mechanics rule. If you can walk through a zombie, he's dead. Again. Was there an empty space? Ah, yes! See? An empty space. Memory's not too bad today. Clunk. Oh, a little model town. Take the gold key. Oh, I know where that goes. It goes in the mansion. It's a di oh, sorry, it's yeah, a diorama. Oh, excuse me. It's not. It's not just a model city. It's a diorama modeled after this facility. There's a hole to put something in. <laughs> <laughs> a memorial plate. There is some writing on it. Dedicated to training facilities completion. December 8th, Alfred Ashford. There's some grenade ammo behind that. I see I see you, grenade ammo. How am I going to get around there? How am I going to get... Can I go watch, walk around the back? No. It needs some... Oh, there's, a, there's an effort, um, a green herb around there as well. Right. So... You know that box of ammo would fit really nicely in there, but I don't think that's what it wants. Do I have anything that would fit in that? Square. Square. No, I don't think I do. But we have just as good an item. We have the gold key to use in the mansion, so... 
that will do nicely. Mansion Ho! <laughs> Somebody said in chat there, oh, there's a, there's a hole. You're like, what are you going to do with it? If it were James from Silent Hill 2, he'd stick his hand through it or jump down it. Uh, that's all That's all fucking Silent Hill characters ever do if there's a hole. It, it, it's very um, innuendo-ish almost in Silent Hill. Typical um, Japanese kind of game, but very, do you know, anytime there's a hole, put something in it. Fist. Your entire body. It don't, it don't matter. Good stuff, dude. Good stuff. Up we go. And in we are. Should we save? Nah, we're fine. We're fine. We've got fine health. We got loads of ammo, I think. We got kind of a lot. I've got a lot of grenade ammo. Got a lot of bow ammo, kind of. Ooh, I don't remember going in this door before. What the fuck? Oh yeah, I do. Yeah, I unlocked it, didn't I? And I think the key got discarded by going in here. Yeah, I remember now. The blue plate was in there, wasn't it? Or some blue plate? Eagle crest? I don't fucking remember. Something got picked up off the floor. Yes. Off the floor. Use the gold key. Yes. Gold key's now useless. Discard. Yes. Get the fuck out of my inventory. Quick little um, bit of the e-cig, hopefully it won't blast my mouth with crap. No, I tried to... get off. I tried to. It just caught me a little bit, they're not too bad. I, I'm gonna have to... I'm gonna order a new e-cig tomorrow, something like that. New um... Oh my god, I fucking hate this room. Oh, I wondered. I didn't think it'd rear its ugly ass head tonight. I thought, you know, I thought this was going to be at least on day two. Oh my god, I'm going to be here for the rest of the fucking night. Ah, oh. picture of a red-haired man. An earthenware plate is also illustrated. There's a button below. Push the button. Fuck no. Ah, oh, this room sucks. So weak. A pure white candlestick. Something is written on the base. In memory of Alexander Ashford's succession. It's been completely broken. Okay. Message to the new family master. Sir Alfred, congratulations on your succession as master of the Ashford family. I hereby present you with an earthenware vase, according to the Ashford family tradition. As you may know, this tradition first began when a butler presented a golden teacup as a commemorative... As a commemorative to Veronica. As a, oh, okay, yeah, it kind of makes sense. A uh, golden teacup as a commemorative to Veronica, as founder of the Ashford family, her intelligence and beauty are legendary. The second and third masters, Stanley and his son Thomas, were also pre uh, presented with similar teacups. It was their hope to achieve glory as Veronica did before them. The position of the family master then shifted from Sir Thomas to his twin brother Sir Arthur. It was then that Sir Edward, your grandfather... Oh, no, sorry. It then went to your... Um, but yeah, it went to Sir Edward. He got it. Then that was when the Ashford family enjoyed its golden age. It was also Sir Edward's achievement that established the large chemical en enterprise Umbrella Inc. Sir Edward is founder. However, when Sir Edward passed away and your fa father, Sir Alexander, succeeded the position, the glorious Ashford family gradually began to sink. Oh, well, that's kind of dissing him a bit. I sincerely hope that the Ashford family regains its glory with your guidance, just as this vase continues to shine eternally. Scott Harmon, butler, Ashford family. Butler dissing one at masses, man? He wants to shut his mouth? It's the same child that's seen in the projector film. There's a message written on the picture. 
Trace the Ashford family legacy. Reveal the true master. There's a button below. Push the button? Yeah, go on then. Eek. Oh wait. This resets all the activation buttons in the room. Okay. So I take it this was kind of seeing the history. Now which way does it want to go? Trace the Ashford family history. Well, I guess it wants to go from reversing it from this big picture here back to the original founder. In which case, so let's... Yes. Oh, maybe it, does it want to go the other way? Oh, they're all flushing now. Well, there's an easy way to find out. You can't push the buttons now. Okay, it's not let me push anything, so I guess that's wrong. Okie dokie, so it wants to go to him as the finish. I need that file. Not the playing manual. Not Hunk's report. Not the playing manual. Not Hunk's report. What's this one? That doesn't do anything. Where the hell is the one I want? Ah, oh, remember to you master, okay, it wasn't this one, okay. Message your family master, right. Sir Alfred, oh yeah, it's the wrong one, um, da da da. Commemorative to Veronica, as founder of the Ashford family, so we need to find Veronica. And then Stanley and his son Thomas, so we need to find, right, we'll take it one step at a time, we need to find, because I'm not spending fucking two days trying to figure this fucking thing out. So let's find a um, a woman first. Well, I found the two things there. Ah! A beautiful woman is holding a tea set. There's a button below. Push the button. Yes, please. So, Veronica is found. Now, middle-aged man is with red-haired twins. No. It's a picture of a man. Pure white candlestick, stick even. It said something about this guy and his son, not about a guy and his two twins. No. Oh, you know what? Let's read the fucking file again, yeah. File. Remember to new master. Blah. 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 They were also presented with similar teacups, so I need to find... Stanley and his son, they have teacups, not vases or anything like that. Or vases, oh you wanna say? Holding a tea set, push it. And another guy holding a tea set? No, it's a plate. No. And he has a white candlestick? No. He has a tea set, but I don't know if this is going to be right. So, anyway, we'll, it must be one of those two in some order or another, so let us um, see if it's going to be correct. On to the next thing. Shifted from Sir Thomas to his twin brother, Sir Arthur. Then shifted from Sir Thomas to his twin brother Sir Arthur, then went to Sir Edward. It was also Sir Edward's achievement that established blah blah blah. However, when Sir Edward passed away and your father said, no, 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 no